Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to set up some Squarespace subscription products in 2024. So today we're going to walk you through the process of setting up subscription products on your uh, Squarespace websites for 2024. Offering subscription products can provide a city stream uh, of, recru of recurring of course revenue and enhancing some customer order loyalty so let's dive into the steps to set up and manage subscription products and let's get started make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience first you'll need to go and access your squarespace accounts so to do so go and open a browser go to the crl section for me here i'm using brave for you can use this every once and basically in the crl section just type square space.com and hit the enter button this should take you into the home screen or main screen if you're logged in you should find your account here if you you're not logged in you'll find the login option here click on it to log into your account or click on get started to create an account you can use google if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of creating or even logging into your account so for me i'll just click on x dashboard so i can access my dashboard right here so of course once you are here if you don't have websites yet make sure to go and create one I've already made a video about this if you want to check it out and you don't have a website yet uh, you'll find this in this channel so make sure to go and check it out and of course i'll just go as example and access this one so here of course i'll just go and access my uh, website or the only website that i have at the moment in squarespace and yeah here we are so once we are here basically so basically if we try to go to settings here in this last panel and we go to third party apps of course you can go to some connected accounts for example and connect one of the accounts that you want but that's not where we'll find the things that you want so for example you can go here through extensions and here we're going to look like for subscription apps so as an example i'll just look for so subscription like example i'll just go here and type subs uh, so subscription so example here if we go and type subscription all we need have is simply email campaigns so how can we add the subscriptions to our products basically if we go here to selling as an example and if we go to products so let's say as an example i want to add the products so i'll just go here and click on add products so let me just wait creating a product why not and it should take some time it should not take a lot of time so just waiting for it until uh, the page loads normally uh, of course here I, I created like physical products if you uh, like over a service if you want to add a service you'll be able to do it downloads also you can add them gift cards and even digital products also you'll be able to add them so as i said for me i'll just choose physical products in here so they're creating products I'll just wait a bit. Of course, you can even like import products from other shops such as Shopify, maybe Equid, uh, Etsy. Maybe you have products on another like platform. You can simply import those products right here without any problem. So here, let me just wait a little bit until it's creating a product. I don't know why it's taking a lot of time. So let me just check if there is like connection. Yeah, connection is working. Uh, I don't know why it's taking some time, so I'll just go to the shell products example. Why not? And as an example, maybe it's going to be a course. I'll see. I'm not sure if there is like a subscription and digital products, but let's just check here. So, yeah, maybe there's something wrong with the Squarespace uh, servers at the moment, but it's fine. I'll just have to wait a little bit for it until it's work and it should be good to go so here is example of course you can select the template or whatever you want or you can start from scratch or whatever it is so yeah maybe the servers are not working as intended at the moment i'll just go back here as we said we're going here to products so yeah you just go here and try to create a physical products and it seems like it's working right now so i'll just go here and click on add an image i'll just upload the file as an example for my pc i'll just use this image click on next and here limited stock as an example why not ten dollars stock unlimited and yeah and click on add more details here description you can add whatever description you want uh, if you don't if you're not like a good assets you can simply use uh, this ai tool as an example a little video here will show you how to use example if you want to read this out basically basically type what you need so creating 
uh, description so description for my new uh, products for my new like I don't know image yeah why not I'll just see what's ever he types so example here as you can see a little like uh, a description here if you like it you can leave it if you don't you can change it or simply ask for something else whatever you want for example you can choose if you want to be a paragraph other things so whatever you want i'll just example make it bold and yeah additional info you can add it for inventory price stock unlimited stock sq if you have it you can add it to fulfillment as example if you have it just it's up advanced shipping etc organizations you can add such selling tools example here to add some feature products, related products, and etc. products review uh, for marketing example, uh, or basically this for SEO. As an example, how it's gonna look like in your in Google or search engines. Basically, when people look at it, you can simply edit it if you didn't like it. Like you can edit the URL, how it's gonna look like, SEO title is good, SEO description, etc. Once you change, just click on apply and etc. And here as you can see on a uh, checkout. So on checkout, as you can see. You have the subscription option so charge customers on recurring basis and offer discount on repeated purchase so we go here you can simply choose one-time purchase and subscription or subscription only whatever suits you depending on the settings that you want and frequently so maybe an example if they pay uh, if they repeat five times maybe per month uh, so the building never expires expires so I'll just put never expires then click on add An example after five months maybe uh, they get something i don't know what sh should i give them like uh, discounts or something like that so basically how to add that's how you add subscription depending on what you want subscription only or one-time purchase whatever you want example so just let's subscription only click on apply and yeah subscription should be added so now i can save this products and basically just publish it on my store right away if i want to and i should be good to go so that's how you set up squarespace subscription products you can do it for all the existing products that you even have or simply created with the products that you're going to add. So that's going to be it for me today. Thank you for watching and goodbye.